Hey, my name is Sharice Davis, and I am the founder of an organization for young ladies called Gloss, God's Ladies of Significance and Service. When I think about my life, when I think about your life and the lives of young ladies all over the world, I'm reminded of how important it is for us to choose to be intentional about being focused, confident, and resilient. Now, let me be transparent and just say that, you know, it's really easy for me to be distracted. I have feelings of insecurity, and sometimes I feel like giving up. And the truth of the matter is there have actually been times that I've actually given up. And I wonder, can you relate? Um, have you ever had those feelings? The good news is that as long as we're still alive, we have the opportunity to try again. Um, we can refocus. And so I wonder, in your life, what is something that you need to refocus on right now? You know, there will always be uh, something for us to learn and for us to conquer. And just think that there was a time when you couldn't tie your own shoes nor spell your name. But now you can do it confidently because you've done it so many times. So think about your life presently. What is it that you need to practice more of so that you can gain confidence? You know, some of our challenges too will be ongoing, like an illness or dealing with the effects of a trauma. For me, it's an unfulfilled desire. But in those instances, perhaps God is trying to teach us resilience, you know, learning how to bounce back after disappointment and pain. Before I go, there's a verse I want to leave with you, and it comes from 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verses 8 through 9, and it says, We are pressed on every side by troubles, but we are not crushed. We are perplexed, but we are not given into despair. We are hunted down, but God never abandons us. We get knocked down, but we are not destroyed. So remember that you can be focused, you can be confident, and you can be resilient.